All right, if you made it this far in this series, first of all, you're a rock star and I appreciate you watching me talk about this topic. I hope it's been helpful to you. I wanna end on talking about sexual shame and how to navigate that because I think it's probably the most important of these topics or these subtopics that we're talking about. <sighs> because shame is not from God. Shame is from the enemy. I feel that very strongly. I believe that very strongly. If you are feeling shame about messing up sexually, about any sort of sexual past, whether that's having sex, going too far in other areas, porn, lust, masturbation, sexual assault, anything that is some sort of damaging sexual experience in your past, shame is not from God. And that is the enemy, the devil, Satan, trying to hurt you and keep you away from Christ. And so I want to just, I want you to hear that and know that is not the heart of God. God longs for us to know him and know his love and know how cared for and seen and known and loved we are. It is not his heart for us to be stuck in shame. That is a trap from the enemy. And if that is where you are today, I just want to say in Jesus's name, I ask for all shame to be removed, all sexual shame to be removed and for you to make new, whoever is watching this, for you to renew their sexuality, renew virginities, renew purity, renew all of these things in their life, God, because you have the power to make all things new. You have the power to renew all of us and bring us to our knees and make us white as snow, Lord. Nothing we can ever do can separate us from your love. And so I just ask that in your name that you would heal the person watching this video, God. I really, really want you to know how loved you are and that this is an important topic. It is serious, but it is also nothing that can keep you from Christ. I hope you hear my heart and I hope that you would see the heart of God through these videos because I wouldn't be making this if I hadn't experienced it myself, if I hadn't experienced the grace of Christ in my own life in this area. And there's nothing that he can't do. There's nothing that he can't restore. There's nothing that he can't redeem, including your sexual past. I love you guys. I appreciate you watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe, all the things, but most importantly, I just want you to know that you're appreciated and that you're loved. I hope you have a good night.